Hi guys, Fentress Charles here, aka Fenny. Okay, so in living the life of your dreams, you're gonna realize something. It's very interesting. In your dreams unfolding, you will come to find that your scheduling, how your life is unfolding, how you are creating your dreams is not going to fit into other people's schedule smoothly. And guess what? They will be upset and mad because what they want you to do, you pursuing your dreams conflicts with it. What do you do? Well, if you endeavor to snatch back your dreams and live it, what should you do? And I remember I did in a previous video about the shoulda, woulda, couldas. Uh, what could you do? You have an obligation. You have a duty to this life, to yourself. To live a life that's worthwhile. To wake up in the morning and be excited about your day to wake up in the morning and look forward to your day. To wake up in the morning and know that when the day is over, you had a productive, good, grand day. A lot of us don't live like that. A lot of us don't think like that. But in the process of carving out the life of your dreams, there's a new mindset. So that's a new mindset that we're, we're carrying now. Your dreams are not going to fit in the schedule of others. It's just not. And I'm not talking about your family, your immediate family. I'm talking about extended family. I'm talking about family, friends, coworkers who feel that your time is more valuable to them than it is to you. You place the value on your time you place the value on other people's opinions and you also place the value on your opinion. And to be honest with you, your opinion about your life, about where you're going, about what you're creating should be the highest opinion. It is the highest opinion above anybody else. I sound very strong and adamant about that because at the end of the day, it is your life and your life is meant to be happy and fulfilling for you on your time and on your sweat equity. Another person can't come into your life and tell you how to run it. A lot of us have lived that life before and it wasn't serving. So now we are carving out a new lifestyle for ourselves always remember so you got to find a way to let people know hey I got you I'll cover you when I can when I'm able and if it fits nicely into my schedule but if not I can't I have a life to build I have a life to create trust me they may be mad at first but in the end you are showing them as you succeed in your endeavors that, hey, they too can carve out the life of their dreams and they don't have to be dependent on someone else in order to make them happy. They don't have to be dependent on someone else's time and efforts in order to be happy. And I think that's a great lesson learned. All right, guys, I'll see you all in the next video. But as usual, say it with me. I endeavor to snatch back my dreams and live it. Peace.